Good morning to you, Chris. Yeah, it is going to be a good week and a nice change for us from all of this damp and really dreary weather that we have had to deal with. So this is what we are seeing right now as we take a live look at Central Park. Still a lot of clouds out there, but it is mostly clear. We've got uh, 48 degrees. That's our current temp. So temperatures this morning are similar to how we started the day yesterday. Want to review yesterday's high temperatures. It was another cool one. Uh, we did max out at 58 degrees for Sussex, New Jersey. Poughkeepsie also made it to 58 degrees. Degrees. It was 57 for Lakehurst, 56 for Islip, Somerville, New Jersey. 60 degrees yesterday. Hadn't, didn't see a whole lot of 60s, but that was one of them. We were at 56 degrees for Teterboro, for White Plains, LaGuardia, and JFK. Uh, Newark was at 58. Central Park yesterday, 55 degrees. That's it, just 55 degrees. That was another very cool day. Today, we're expecting a high of 61 degrees. Now, we should be at 69. We don't quite get there, but at least the high temperature starts with a six, so we're moving in the right direction. We take a look at your satellite and radar. We continue to see uh, some echoes here, so not sure that that's actually making it to the ground. What we do know we have is a little bit of fog out there this morning. So for some uh, communities in New Jersey, a couple pockets of some fairly dense fog that might slow you down a bit. For the rest of us, just a few clouds out there, mostly dry conditions. And again, we'll likely see some sunshine this morning. But it has been a wet run. We had seven consecutive days of rain. So it's just been a tough one. We don't typically see that. And of course, after such a dry April right until the very end, uh, it is a little, you know, surprising to see seven consecutive days of rain. So it doesn't stop today. Although we start the morning with some drier conditions and we do anticipate seeing some sunshine this morning, we will see increasing clouds as we head into the early afternoon hours and that will lead to at least a chance of some scattered showers. So for some, it may be more like scattered drizzle, but still a possibility that we'll see some wet weather by the end of the day. This is five o'clock and we may see a couple of cells developing with some more moderate downpours and still a chance for some rain at about nine o'clock tonight. Then we get significant clearing overnight and tomorrow morning and it does look like we will be mostly sunny on your Saturday as temperatures return to normal. Mostly sunny on Sunday as temperatures go above normal. But one thing I do want to point out this particular model is showing us an increase in clouds on your Sunday evening and it is showing us some shower activity pushing through. Want to point that out. It won't really shouldn't ruin your plans but I do want you to know that that is a possibility so we'll keep an eye on that. Otherwise, we were a touch milder today at 61 degrees. You do still need to grab the umbrella before heading out the door because we had that chance of afternoon showers. But you can see the weekend mostly sunny with highs in the upper 60s and low 70s. With that, I'll send it back to you.